All right, all right. We're playing Gloomhaven. Uh, yeah, and we're doing Prison Break here. We're gonna fight some bandits, get the Jagged Sword. Seems like an easy enough mission. Mm. We're sticking with this team. We're soon gonna replace the Doomstalker, I think. Just gonna reach level 80. Level 9 first. And then we'll uh, replace him. Now, if you are a fan of Gloomhaven and see this VOD or on YouTube, and you kind of want to know when I'm playing it, uh, at the moment I'm not playing it on a scheduled stream, so please just send me a message on Twitch and say, hey, could you do like Gloomhaven on Thursdays or something? And I'll probably do it. I'm nice that way. Uh, maximum health at the end of the mission, sure. Kill someone. Undamaged monster. Yes, that's easy. Kill an elite monster. Let's try that. Do a lot of damage. Okay. Kill someone by doing four more points of damage. That that's that should be possible. Should be possible. So, oh, we're not going back in there. You'll have to kill us first. Um, okay. I like the brute. He says exactly what I'm thinking. Um, this first room seems simple. So, what do we do here? Uh, I don't think we want to use the major mana potion here. <coughs> I think we want to push this guy into a trap. So, we're actually going to put you like over here. We're going to do the black arrow and swallowed by fair. And the Doomstalker. We can put the bear in front here. Do we want to... We can immobilize both of these guys. And then just move away. <coughs> or... Or we could do maul and focused aggression. That's a burn card. Are you kidding me? Then it's not good. I was like, this is insane. But it's also a level one card, so I should have figured that out. Uh, okay. Damn it. Um, I'll do this one. That will probably deal with those two. And... I'll move and push. Yeah, I'll move there and push him into that one or something. That's good. Uh, you can stand there, actually. No, you need to stand over there. One, two, three, four, five range. I don't have five range. Okay, let's put him there. And we'll do... Press the attack and rain of arrows. Try and deal with the archer in the back. And the summoner here will summon someone. And make them attack. Actually, you want to stand like there. Yes. We'll summon the void eater. That's my goal to summon at the moment, and we'll let him do an attack. So we curse someone. The bear can stand over there, no problem. <coughs> Archers are moving. Oh, they're moving quite early. Okay. Uh, they're attacking for three with poison. That's unfortunate. Now, this does seven damage. I'll go for him. Maybe we get lucky and you kill him. <laughs> Take three damage and add. I mean, sure. It's just. I mean, it doesn't really push. Oh, eight damage. If I get plus two, he dies. Yeah, let's receive the damage. No worries. 
Oh, he's really close to being dead. Okay. Let's try him. Get plus one here. Oh, we got dark magic as well. Nice. And then the push is gonna actually kill him. Uh, let's just move. Yeah, we'll get closer. We'll take a hit. He's dead. We got some curses out and everything. Ha! <laughs> That's nice. But I've cursed like one guy and yeah. Four damage, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Beast Tyrant, let's do this, yes. What are they doing? Yeah, they're not doing ranged attacks. Target one enemy, push him over there. That's actually a kill as well. Okay. And let's just immobilize the elite bandit guard here. Means he's not dangerous. The only problem now is that... Damn it. Yeah. He doesn't really have any targets from this position. These two should have switched. Okay. I get the experience still, I think. Skip attack. And... Well... <laughs> Skip ability. We get one experience still. Awesome. This was... What? What is this? This is... Really easy. Um... I think we just do like... We want to get expose out. Here. Then you move and you kill this guy. <coughs> now, he has a bit more. HP. Can, how do we deal with that? We do poison attack. And you can actually move to get a little more damage. That's fine. Um, you do have Pierce over here. So we will move and do the Pierce attack. Uh, we could go invisible. Can't do quite frenzy then. That will be an attack for five. Okay, let's just do this. I think this should be enough. Yes. I mean, the pierce is good, but I really like having advantage on all my attacks. Expose. Fantastic card. I really like that. And it's really good against... I mean, putting that on this guy. That would be great. And then I could actually have moved him and attack. That would have been better. Probably. Let's just get you... Over there. We get advantage. This is a kill. Hmm. He got the dynamo attack. Cool. <laughs> or the the quest. Kill someone by causing a lot of damage. Great. Let's do Oh, we want to move. Add one attack. Cool. my command card, so we do this one. Okay. Beast Hunter. Pretty cool guy. Uh, okay. Let's move over here. Now, actually, this will only give me plus two attack. So I'll rather do this with six. Oh, that's a nice hit. 
Cool, cool. White Eater. He's gonna miss. So it shouldn't be possible for my summoner here to miss. This should be a kill. Yes. Great. That was easy. So one, two, three, four, five, six. I could just run in here and start punching people. We're gonna go. We're gonna go hard here. And you can do suffer damage and just attack someone. Maybe kill someone with this. That would be fun. Let's do the multi. No. We want to save the burn cards for the last room, I think. Let's try impending end here. We will try and go late. <clears throat> the bottom is kind of good. And we'll do this one. Okay. I'm now I'm playing a lot faster than I usually do. Uh Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. We have another move actually. This room has more escapees. Oh, there is rubble here. Yeah, no worries. What is he doing? Okay, we are gonna get hit by this guy. <coughs> but that's fine. What is he doing? He's not really doing anything. Okay, cool. Let's just give them poison. You can't shoot that far. You could with this. That doesn't really help me. Um, okay, let's do the doom on him. I really should have the extra, the helmet with... Oh yeah, I don't have a helmet. I'm just gonna have to skip the attack here and then take a punch from him. That's three damage with poison, no problem. And a trap. Oh. The bear is moving. One, two, three, I could go there. Yeah. Let's just run into the trap here. Not gonna be able to push him off the trap. It does like three damage. Ooh. Yeah, no problem. Uh, skip movement. And we'll do the attack. You miss, really. I think you put out the curse anyway, so that's fine. <clears throat> He's moving forward. I need to move forward as well. Let's... Why not? Just get the coin as well. Let's go for him. Cool. I really love this guy. Um, ah. Okay, you are now invisible. You're not going to be able to use that to much effect. Attack twice here. 
Or you can move and attack. Let's do those two. I think we're gonna have to move with our... There. Huh. Beast Tyrant. And just shield. And move to. We'll pick up the coin. Okay. Now, you need to do some damage here. Hmm. Do I just take move to? What does damage? This one does a little bit of damage. <coughs> one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, let's get into the room. <coughs> this isn't great, but not really doing that much damage here. Heal someone? He attacks for four and metal. He attacks with poison. He's early though. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, but there is jump on this one. Really? Okay, let's go there. <clears throat> Do I just take this hit? I think we do. He's just gonna attack the bear. It's not a problem. Okay, let's just shoot here. Plus one, great. <clears throat> Moves over there, that's fine. Poison, we need to start healing people. Oh, you're gonna go for him now, of course. Just shielding him. Yeah. Picking up some coins, that's fine. Hmm. Do I go for him? He suffers two damage at the start of his turn, so he's dead. That's nice. Let's go to the door. And we'll probably kill this guy as well now. I really like the Night Shroud. He's fun. Uh, yeah, we're done. And then you can actually just get some coins over here. And I think we will, hmm, let's remove the poison on the bear. This is fine. You're gonna long rest. You are going to move three and heal self. I think that's a good idea. Let's do these two. Let's long rest. Let us long rest. <coughs> Heal self four. That's pretty sick. Only removes poison at this point. But still, skip attack. Now we actually have difficult terrain in front of us. Can we use that for anything? Not sure. Uh, let's remove... I'm so far behind, so this is useless at the moment. That's how I usually end up with my B 
be started. He's just moving around to pick up coins while moving his bear around. Um, do we get rid of... Black knives. Yeah, sure. And the night shroud's turn. Let's get the dark magic. Yes. I think that's a good idea. Uh, and uh, let's do this. Now he can go in and do some pretty cool and insane damage. Um... I should really, I should summon the Lava Golem, I think. And unfortunately, I cannot throw away Earth and Seed here. Um, this is hard. I don't think I need the Healing Spirits. I'm really good at not, or my team is really good at not taking damage. Uh, let's do a move with dark magic and do quiet frenzy <coughs> that's gonna allow him to position himself pretty much anywhere and then do an insane amount of damage let's short rest this mm. let's redraw this that was not a good redraw but okay we will go Hmm. I think we'll just do these two. We're gonna go late, because he's invisible. Might lose some damage because of it, but that's fine. Let's do the command where we move my guy. And do the unstoppable one. We are moving late with people. I don't think we need to go early. The bandit archers will be able to hit me, but... Okay. That's fine. What do we do? I should really have put out the healing sprite when I think about it, but okay. Uh, I think we're gonna heal. And... Okay, we'll do this. We can move someone. That's fine. Oh, wait. So... If I move three now, I cannot use the boots. That irritates me at times. More demons! What are these? Who are... Who's fighting who here? What's going on? Kill all enemies. I need to kill everything here, right? But I think maybe these guys are fighting. Let's go here. The Earth Demon is attacking for four and three. That's fine. I think they're fighting, actually. So we're going to go all the way in here. Let's use this one. We get poison on all of these guys. That's pretty cool. Then we get this. With this and this. I mean, this just seems like fun. Doing this amount of damage. Well, let's attack those two. Sure. Curse on both of them. Okay. Oh, no! I forgot to use my cloak first. Damn it! Let's get quite frenzy back here. We got dark magic. Cool. Bandits are... Retaliating. Okay. I think this icon means that they're on, like, a different team. I guess we'll find out. The Void Eater is moving. Now. Damn it. 
Void Eater is going to get attacked at this point. And if I perform move 3 here, that's not good. I forgot about this. He's just gonna move closer. Crap. Okay. We'll put him in harm's way. And we'll heal... Um... Bear? Okay, this is... This didn't plan out the way I wanted it to. So I think this guy is gonna go for my Void Eater and he will kill it actually. So I'll rather just tank with this guy. Let's jump. Let's, let's be a tank here. And put this out. Doesn't have a lot of health though. We need... Let's put... Let's put out her. And this. We can get a kill next turn then. Three damage. That's not a big deal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so this is... Seems like an easy mission. I should just concentrate on this guy. Poison, great. And maybe take out the archers. If I can. Yeah, you're not gonna move forward, so... The bear is coming up here. Hmm. Do I want to put it... No, I'll just put it right there. Hmm, skip movement. Let's do some extra damage. What? Okay, confirm target. Five damage, okay. <clears throat> Let's get some cards back. I think we're just gonna take these up again. <coughs> All right. Uh, these guys are fighting. We need to kill him. You have do you can kill someone now right now. So yes, let's go late and kill someone. And we'll just move one. I think that's fine. Then we move one and we can use the cloak next turn. Ah, how about this? One, two, three, four. You could start shooting people. You have expos. You have... Hmm. Let's put out... I don't know. Do I have any... Rain of Arrows? Yes, let's do that. And this one, that's fine. Okay, now he's gonna die pretty quickly, so I shouldn't be attacking him. The bear. What do you want? I just let this guy attack a couple of times. Yes. And we'll do the same thing as earlier. Was there traps around here? No. We'll do the move five again. Yeah. Okay, let's see how this goes. 
Do not kill him before it's... What do the bandits do? They move... Two. Oh, cursed. That's fine. I can put my bear right here. One, two, three, four. Okay, okay. Let's go for the archers. I like how he's just standing almost where he started. Let's go for those two. What? No damage. How many curses do these guys have have now? We got like five curses. That's good. Uh, end turn. Yes. Doomstalker here. Let's start dealing damage to him. You're gonna go invisible. I think he's gonna like. This guy have have to move somewhere else then. Mmm, yeah, this is fine. Nice. Standing in the door while being invisible is really effective. But is it a good strategy? I mean, it's kind of a coward's strategy. Uh, yes, let's do him. Skip movement. Let's attack. Oh, poison! That's cool. He attacks three times. Now, what that means is a lot of curses. Hmm. <laughs> what do we want back here? I'll take both of those back, actually. That's cool. They're just gonna fight among themselves. That's cool. How many curses do they have? More and more. Oh, no. Yeah, let's do this. He's dead. Okay. I don't like that they were using up their curses on each other. Let's do a kill. Oh, you haven't killed an undamaged monster yet? Damn it. Mmm. I don't want the gold. Let's get the gold. And then we'll move and be invisible. And do this one? Sure. That's decent. Now we need the bear to do some damage as well. <coughs> <coughs> um poison this one maybe yeah let's use the bottom hair now it's gonna be a lot of damage you can do multi-pronged assault or you could do hmm yes let's use these two can attack with this one and I can attack with that one that's cool he's gonna move forward here probably over here or something I could put out the lava golem but he's just gonna die <clears throat> maybe the ooze or I could just move forward and
make my guy attack more. Let's do that. Yeah. <clears throat> no point in spending too much time thinking about what to do when we're doing this well. Uh, where do we want to stand? I think we want to kind of kind of want to get closer to these guys but I definitely don't want to hit the bandit there. Skip movement. Let's go invisible. <coughs> okay, four damage. That's nice. And we'll stay invisible. Yep. The void eater is gonna go over here. No, damn it. That means we kind of have to... Let's go there. Let's keep movement. And we'll move our Void Eater... Over here, I think. Skip movement. Let's try and kill this guy. Oh, dark magic! Sweet! Let's get some cards back. Uh, I don't need an element. I'll do these two. Let's get cards back. I mean, you can just use the same cards over and over again. <laughs> um, yeah, let's do those. Okay, that's nice. You can poison someone. <coughs> we kind of want to... What? This is a bandit archer. This is an elite bandit archer. Okay, we'll poison him and hopefully we'll kill the other one with this one. Two experience as well. Awesome. Come on. Do not screw this up. Fantastic. And then my bear is gonna get hit by both the archer and the other guy. Oh, it's him first. Range three. So if you go over there, you can shoot both of these guys. And we'll attack him. Hmm. Why did I do... Okay. We'll go for the kill over here. Hmm. Kind of want to kill him as well. So he doesn't go after my... Uh, my other guy there. Let's get an extra target here. Oh! Slit little Yuki! Thank you for the follow. That is muchly appreciated. Did I miss him? Seriously. <sighs> Cover a card? Sure. I'll do camouflage here. Oh, he's actually in trouble. Hey man, how are you doing? You a Gloomhaven fan? Three damage to the bear. I'll take that. That is fine. Okay. Okay, he survived. That's good. Or we might have had the other one attacking my... Uh... Yeah. Oh, man. The campaign? It's like... What is it? Four days? Five days? Is it the 20th or the 22nd? Uh, let's move the Doom. Yeah, okay. Over to him, I guess. I am really looking forward to the campaign. I mean, I've played it uh, uh, on the board game with my friends, but... 
I don't get to play all the time, you know. 20th, so it's like three days. Oh, God. That's gonna be cool. There's a few classes I haven't tried yet as well. I really only played the, the classes I've uh, unlocked in the board game at this point. And yeah, here we have four of the new classes. I didn't really, I didn't realize that. I'm not playing with any of the basic ones right now. Um, okay, this is pretty much done, I guess. Let's just do these. We attack and my Void Eater attacks. I mean, this guy, I love this guy, the Void Eater. I'm a big fan of curses. So he was pretty cool. Um, I haven't been able to use this impending end to any great effect. Black Arrow is good. White Frenzy, sure. <laughs> Have you played with the Beast Tyrant before? He just ends up standing way in the back. Do we have any shields here? No. Let's patch and attack. <clears throat> I think they should die now, right? Oh, that's almost a kill. Let's get some coins here. And try and kill him as well. Plus two to attacks against someone who has one health. Yay! Awesome! <laughs> uh, what do we do here? Oh, I could do so much damage at this point. I guess we kind of need to shoot him. Let's just use an item. Because why not? Oh, poison. Coins, coins. How are we on curses at this point? They're like five, okay. I thought I had done more curses than that. Earth magic, 8 damage. Great. Let's heal the bear. Alright. What's up next here? Uh, yeah. <coughs> I was not aware that the summoner had so many... Uh... uh summons with ranged abilities that's pretty cool uh okay skip ability and we're done prison break finished fantastic what time is it now i think i could do one more mission before i end it today Then I'll have, I am uploading what missions for YouTube uh, every second day. And, and now I was almost out of missions to upload, so I needed to get some new ones here. Uh, did we get, okay, oh, oh, Beast Tyrant level up. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Rampage. That's cool. Anyone summoned ally. Anyone. Okay. So I could possibly do that on the summoners. Summons. That's good. And this is Monolith, which basically is a tank. 
Hmm. <coughs> I think it's gonna have to be Rampage here, right? And uh, this one I will remove. Rampage is really good for the bottom. Stone Sigil. What's my... Mo okay. I mean, replacing this one is good. Move 5. This has also move 5 without the experience, though. Uh, but it doesn't really matter what's on top, because I usually uh, only... I always use this. So it's not going to be... It's going to be Rampage here. And that means I have a good bottom. This one is a burn. This arm... I rarely use the disarm, and I never bothered to use this one. Even though it's kind of good. And this I never use. Let's get rid of that one. Yeah. This is one, two, three attacks and two... <laughs> Rampage is fine. Fun. Oh, yeah. So Guildmaster is basically you start out in this town uh, and it's kind of a campaign on its own and then you recruit the six first classes. Uh, that's kind of the tutorial where you just learn how the game works and stuff. I think you can skip that. So you start in this town with the six basic mercenaries. Uh, after that uh you can do the travel missions which i have like i have this one i can travel here i get a new item i can buy and then i unlock silver wick which is a new city now you can see that i've unlocked all of i think all of these names are travel missions that i've done and there's a story around it so like if I want to go over to Unlikely Alliance here, there's something with the Brute, if you're into the story. So every time you unlock a new city, then you get access to unlocking more cities and more of the story. And you get new items and you meet new enemies usually. I think like... Yeah, over here, I haven't really met Earth Demons and Flame Demons at all earlier. Uh... So basically, you expand the territory you can move in and get new items and you meet more advanced enemies. That's the travel missions. So they're basically the story, I think. Then you have the jobs, which are just small missions where you go in, kill something and you get a new uh, item design. So if I go here, kill this one, I would get access to a falcon figurine that I can buy. I already have one, but then I can get two of them. Or I have the Dampening Ring over here. Or the Skull, Skullbane Axe here. Uh, and... For now, uh, some of these things are behind uh, my beautiful face, I imagine. But you have the Story Missions. They are missions for your mercenaries. So, for example, I can access the Mind Thief quest where you would get a perk point if you do that uh, they are kind of hard usually and I don't know where uh, I have the summoner here for example and I need to unlock the starting village way aboard to get the next summoner quest also at the bottom here which you can't really see you have relic Missions, I think. Yeah. Here's one. I can't. Yeah. Here's a relic missions. So that's where you get like really strong artifacts. I think my Night Shroud has, for example, the remote spider hair, which poisons everyone around him. That one I unlocked from a relic mission. So as you play, you unlock more things at the merchant. I unlocked the Jagged Sword now, which I don't really think I want, because 
Uh, that would be for my Night Shroud, but he has a Weeping Skite, which I really like. Get to attack three people for a lot of damage, usually. But you would unlock more and more items, and then... At the trainer here, you can get, like, kill quests to get more money. You can get new enchants. Oh, I can soon afford another enchant, actually. And I think for some of the enhancements... Yeah. Complete the six elemental masteries. So I would need to consume 15 light elements. Then I can enhance my items with light. Bless, um... <laughs> can't really do bless here. Yeah, I think... I've played the campaign. Uh, or I am playing the campaign on the board game. So I really like this one. And you will unlock all of the characters here as well. I think the characters are a bit easy to unlock. I kind of want one of them to be harder. So I'm not trying like... Well, the Berserker, Soothsinger, Plague... Plague Herald and stuff. Uh, I will try them out if I get them in the campaign. Uh, but these others I've unlocked playing the board game before, so I thought like, yeah. Summoner, Night Shroud, Beast Tyrant, and the Doomstalker. Those are actually all the four characters I've unlocked in the board game, and I'm using all of them. What? You've been in your room and you're... Why isn't your computer in your room? <laughs> What's going on, dude? <laughs> that would be the first thing I was like, okay. Isolated. Nine days. Let's get my computer up and running. I would survive being isolated easily. That would mean just playing games. Oh man, that's... I mean, that's bad planning. Or unlucky, I guess. Uh, oh! Yeah, the Night Shroud is level 7. Let's... Oh my god. Gloom darts. With dark magic, I can target three people with poison and curse range four and the bottom is really good as well sorry dude <laughs> ah okay okay hmm well man you that when you're isolated, that should have been like, we need to give you your computer for this. Oh, Gloom Dodge looks pretty sick. Attack 5, add poison, muddle, and wound, and gain... Oh, God. What do I do here? I mean, this is so much fun. But I think we're gonna do... We're not trying to be a ranged Night Shroud. Move 3 and Invisible, and it's Love Initiative. Let's do that. I think the other card is better. But... That means we remove Cloak of Shade, definitely. Yeah, the Night Shroud is, I think, probably my favorite character. I played the board game with Doomstalker and the Night Shroud. And, I mean, the Night Shroud was just, he was invisible all the time. He just ran around, nobody cared about him, and the Doomstalker has great range. So he was just standing in the back, and everything was moving towards the Doomstalker. That was a pretty sick team, to be honest. Um, let's find out what we're doing next here. 
I mean, I should probably... Wayward? Where is Wayward? Can I get that city? That's South Shield, so no. Silverwick. Sweetwater. Iron Bell. What? I want to get some of the missions for my guys here. Crystal Hollow? So I'm just looking at what I need to get the next story missions. East Grow. Eagle Crest. South Shield? What's that? Could I get South Shield here? Okay, let's just ignore that then. And... I mean, let's... You are immune to stun and muddle. I think I'll do this one next. We gotta unlock some more... Koreas, I guess. Or... Oh! Sweetwater. Then I can do the next, next Beast Tyrant quest. Okay. So I'm gonna do this. I'm just gonna take a quick break, like one minute. And then we'll uh, do the next one. Let's just get this perk first. Um... <laughs> okay, let's add an invisible card. I have all the perks soon on the night shroud here. That's kind of cool. And we can add a perk to my beast tyrant as well. Yeah, let's remove some minus one cards. Okay. I'll be back in one or two minutes. <laughs> 